like the man of minutes and one as a pair of top performing RWL women's champions meet for the first time on both even and good terms for a simple one-on-one -on -one non-title contest. It's Triple Crown Champ Liberty Belle Danielle set to face the longest reigning women's champion of all times, Dynamite Jeannie Parker. Here's Liberty Belle Danielle Heathcote, the other half of American powers, The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing the League of Nations. From Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, one half of the Women's World Tag Team Champions, the All-American Bell Day. 2023's Rookie of the Year and RWL's first women's triple crown champion. One half of the women's tag champs are WL Women's International Champ and the first choice Grable Memorial Champion. For you, that friends, is one long list of achievements and nearly all of it accomplished in six short months. It's not hype if you can back it up and whether in singles or tags, this young submission specialist can stand on an astounding win-loss record. Oh, guys, this has been a blast, but I gotta tell you, I can't wait to get back to the hotel to struggle to find a position to sleep in. And representing Les Femmes Vetas from Richmond, Virginia, the Women's World Champion, the Queen. With the Women's World Championship train on pace to reach six years this summer, a laundry list of defeated contenders, challengers, and random opponents. The sexy soul sister of the squared circle has just been a dynamo in that ring, and this match tonight with Danielle is a sign of goodwill between the two champions, who have allied themselves against the looming threats of the Bell Council, so to swipe a phrase, this champion's duel is actually the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Let's test that theory out right now. They lock it up. Genie. Whips Daniel. Oh, almost got another unlucky referee here. Daniel with a counter. Genie counters with elbows to the midsection. Genie counters with a right. Has her up. Drops her and delivers a kick. Daniel counters with a kick of her own. Oh man, this is gonna be crazy. Huh. Again, Jeannie Parker. Not letting Danielle seize control. Flying fist off the rope. Jeannie gathers Danielle up. Oh, oh, and there's that sweet hard right right there. Danielle. Finding herself with some trouble in the early goings here. Jeannie driving knees into the chest. Danielle Heathcote. Oh, was going to try it again, but missed. Danielle gets herself back up. She's got Jeannie against the ropes here. Jeannie locks it up with her. Takes her down with a short clothesline. Rounds her back up again. Oh, what a slam. Oh, man, Jeannie Parker is just... Oh, she's lit up right now. Okay, and into... Oh, into a submission thing here, and... I don't think Danielle's gonna tap. That's just not gonna happen, not right away, not too soon. Huh, it's way too soon for that, but, oh man. Jeannie really leaned in on that one out there. Oh, huh. got her up. Carrying her to the corner, snake eyes into the buckle, and down she goes. Danielle locks it up from behind. Whoa, -hoo, one arm suplex, beautifully done. Jeannie. Wait with the counter again. Danielle counters with a dragon screw. Huh. Now Danielle stretching that arm and shoulder. Oh, Jeannie Parker. Jeannie back to her feet. Draws a knee into the skull. Huh. Man. These guys are friends? Okay, whatever. <laughs> All right, well, Jeannie. Gathers it up slow again and 
One more time with that hard, sweet right hand. All the way up on the third rope. Brings the knees down into the chest. Goes for cover here. But just a two. Well, she thought it was over, but uh, referee says nope. Not quite. Okay, springboard moonsault says here, let me try this again. No, just the two, Danielle, getting that shoulder up. Yeah, tough little cookie, Danielle, he's goat. All right, she's got Jeannie against the ropes here. Jeannie counters, goes behind, oh, oh, this isn't good. That's that trap squeeze again, blocking the blood flow to the brain of the opponent. And Danielle starting to sink out here. Oh. Now, Jeannie. Waiting for her to get back to her feet here. Goes for it again. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, that's hard. Oh, she's done that a lot of times and won a lot of matches that way. Oh, and Danielle goes down. Jeannie going for the pin here. Hooks the leg. No. Just a two. Jeannie's on the referee. Come on, man. What are you doing? They lock up one more time. Danielle with a kick to the midsection. Right, and a chop. Look at this here. Oh, he's going for the suplex, but Genie just a little too fast. Danielle misses with a drop kick. They lock up again. Genie whips Danielle to the far corner. Misses with a kick. Thomas with a kick to the midsection. Oh man, that's Genie Parker. A series of shots takes Danielle down to the canvas again. Rounds her up. Oh. Into that submission, into the crossface, and referee watching this close. Danielle looks like she might tap. Oh man, this. Oh shit, and Jeannie's just leaning into it. Oh, look at this. Jeannie releases the hold here. Oh. Leg scissor, knee dropped. Huh. Jeannie, going for the cover again. Nope. Oh, man. Whoa, I told you Daniel was tough, didn't I? Huh. All right, Jeannie. Having a oh, misses with the stomp. Jeannie found out she's going to have to put in a little work here. Huh. Drives a knee into the skull. Mm, that one smarted. Daniel pushes away. Just in time, too. Huh, she's got Jeannie up. Look at this right here, inverted suplex, beautifully done. Now Danielle, into an arm bar, off and close to the ropes. But Jeannie, oh, manages to sneak her way out of it. And delivers a knee to the head too. Oh, huh. hard forearm. Oh, <laughs> Jeannie Dynamite. A little bit of sass right there. Oh, close line takes Danielle down. Another one takes Danielle down a second time. Hold on a second here. Oh, oh leg trip. Oh, oh, and Jeannie is lit up. Oh, yeah. All right. Going for the cover here. Whoa, shut up. Oh, man. Oh, a lot of near falls in this bad boy. Oh. Jeannie gets her up again, but Danielle, with the counter, has Jeannie against the ropes. Now just bouncing her off the ropes with hard shots to the back. Going right back into the arm submission. Now, flip over neck whip. A stomp to the leg. And another. Danielle. Nasty chop and a shot midsection and has her up and a oh, oh, rib breaker. Now Danielle. Looks like she's got control of things for us here. Oh, oh, backbreaker. Huh. Yeah, Danielle. Just got lit up somehow. Huh. Dini with a fast counter here. Has her up on the shoulder. No, Danielle with another counter. This butterfly suplex. Huh. 
Yeah, Danielle, she ain't, she ain't playing. Huh? She's got genie. She's got genie banged her ass here. Oh. Into a, into, a, into a leg lock here, and oh, man. Yeah, she's leaning into it pretty good. Releasing the hold. Rounds her back up. Takes her back down. And into another arm submission. Hmm. The genie. And just a slide her way out of it. Now genie with a hard series of shots. But Danielle whips her into the ropes, kitchen sink, knee to the midsection, follows it up with a flip over neck whip. Just like that, Danielle going for cover here. Whoa! Just about a one. Oh, Genie with another counter. With a right. Oh, just takes Danielle down. Starts pummeling the girl. All right, Genie Dynamite. Getting ready. The fuse is lit here. Here we go. Oh, the trap squeeze again. Oh, she's already gone through two of those. I don't know if Danielle's going to be able to endure a third one. Oh, and there she goes. Oh. And Genie. Going for the cover. Here's the ref. Three. That's it. Genie Parker wins by pinfall. That was a fight and a half, guys, I mean. Nobody was backing down an inch. And while they didn't go out of their way to hurt one another, they sure weren't taking it easy in there. What a terrific performance from two outstanding champions. And all, oh, hey, check this out. The champ invites the triple crowner to take a victory lap for herself, too. What a great display of sportsmanship that a lot of the ladies around here could learn a little something from. And now with this match in the books, they will turn their attention toward the Bell Council. Man, I'll tell you what, they sure did not fool around. I mean, they gave, they left everything in the ring. I'm, I'm real impressed. That was a terrific match. What a match, what a finish, and what a card, and what a tour it has been, guys. That's going to wrap things up here for us. Thanks as always for being with us. And as I mentioned earlier, we're going to be setting up the new WWE The K20 for software. So we're technically gonna be closed but running on a limited schedule till we resume regular shows in just a few days. But we'll be bringing you all kinds of new matches, stars, and excitement. Until then, keep those notifications on because we'll be back in just a few days when we return stateside to Los Angeles. For all of them at our WL, Wally Cardell, saying thanks. Good night and be safe. Peace out, everybody.